Did you know that the original electrical grid in downtown Austin was built in the 1930s? To modernize the electrical grid and ensure an energy transmission system that is reliable, resilient, and ready for future growth, Austin Energy is performing a series of capital improvement projects to build new and improve existing energy facilities and infrastructure. Austin Energy's Repowering Downtown initiative involves a variety of upgrades to meet the needs of our city. As part of the Repowering Downtown initiative, Austin Energy is adding a third substation serving downtown in the Rainy Street District, as well as a complete rebuild of the existing Breckenridge substation. Really the point of starting this substation was Austin has always been a fast growing city, but in the last decade it's really just grown exponentially and we realize that this is the right time to put a substation, a third substation to serve the downtown network. The Rainy Street substation will provide increased electrical capacity to meet downtown growth and will allow Austin Energy to continue to provide reliable power downtown. We acquired the land for the new substation back in 1999 for the purpose of someday adding an additional substation to serve the fast-growing downtown network. We started working with the community in 2017. Then in July of 2021, the Austin City Council approved our construction contract, which allows us to start building. We're so excited to be starting construction on the Rainy Street substation. Because the Rainy Street substation is in a very visible area of downtown, we went through a very thorough community engagement process. We had three rounds where we talked to the community about their concerns during the first round. We came back and presented some design ideas for them in the second round. And then in the third round, we really showed them what design it was they chose. And we heard from over 600 different people about what it is they were looking for in the Rainy Street substation. Hello, I'm Donna Carter and I'm the project architect for the Rainy Street substation. The site really is seen as a transition between the Mexican-American center behind as well as the very active rainy area but also the Waterloo Greenway. And within that we have then chosen to have landscaping that really highlights the four heritage trees that are left intact on the site. But we've introduced drought tolerant landscaping and then on the street, we have benches, shaded, wider sidewalks, and we have an electric vehicle charging station. The Rainy Street substation is actually a gas-insulated facility, and that means that it is a smaller footprint and that the equipment for the switchgear itself can actually be enclosed. This is perfect for small, compact urban sites. The backbone of it is really was the community input that we got that really allowed us to focus on what we feel is the infrastructure becoming a real, a visual part of the downtown experience. Electricity is generated from power generation plants and renewable energy, such as wind and solar. It is then transmitted at high voltages across transmission lines substations receive the high voltage energy and transformers reduce the energy down to a voltage level that can be safely delivered to customers. Energy is delivered to homes and businesses through a network of above ground and underground distribution circuits. The 706 and a half Lambie Street site near Rainy Street was chosen strategically because it meets electrical requirements and allows access to existing electrical transmission and distribution circuits. So far, the relocation of the water and wastewater lines is completed, and now the construction of the substation is set to begin next and will be providing electricity by 2023. As construction moves forward, Austin Energy will provide updates about any expected impacts to neighbors, traffic, the construction timeline, and any other information. We look forward to celebrating the completion of the Rainy Street substation in 2023. Before then, we'll share information with nearby neighbors throughout the entire process. Please visit our website to sign up for updates.